Hello and welcome to another one of our product um, review videos and today we're going to be looking at a laboratory scissor jack made by a company called Stony Lab. This particular model is uh, 150 by 150. Um, it can um, move weights of up to 10 kg up and down and it has a maximum height once adjusted from 75 mil to uh, 260, so 7.5 centimeters or 26 centimeters. Um, it's all metal construction, so it has rubber feet. As a, so this has just come out of the box, came well wrapped. Um, keep it nice and clean with this. Uh, it's just got a turn knob there. So we'll just show how it moves. It's quite quite easy and smooth operation. So what's it say? Go up to 250. 260 mil or 26 so let's, centimeters. Let's get it all the way up and see if that is true because for some people depending on what you're using it for that is quite important so it's got plenty of thread left but once you run out of thread obviously that's your height you wouldn't want to do any faster than that so let's do so it so we're nearly there 260 right okay how stable is it at stable um, right, I basically got backs of bolts and nuts just to see. So apparently, you can take 10 kg of weight. Obviously, that's not 10 kg, but um, it's, it's a weight. good good demonstration of the scissor jack, um, and it's fairly accurate. It's fairly quick to take up and down as well, which is important, and it does stay relatively firm and in position. Obviously, it's important depending on what you're using it for. What I like about this, it is obviously it's the, th the, the thread, the fine thread, so it is quite easy to adjust. I've seen some places people talking about this coming off. I think you just, just need to check this nut at the back is tight. But um, this was about 30 that some about pound. Then. Yeah. Um, we looked at other cheaper ones. I couldn't tell you if they're any different. Um, the reason we went for the better one, it had screws in the top lid and it just looked better. It's not going to slip because of those rubber feet, which is good. Um, I guess over time you might just need to put a drop of oil in there to be honest. A little bit of, maybe just a little bit of grease along this. Yeah, nothing too much. Um, and, and it is quite fine, the adjustment, which is nice. You know, you can get to where you want to go with it. So. Uh, we, we want it for specific purpose to get height to something um, and we're going to put like a tray on top uh, basically a little workbench going up to something um, it's 150 mil square or 15 centimeters by 15 centimeters or if you're old like me just under six inches square yeah. uh, it's quite compact and lightweight um, the description of the product it does what it says it does the only important thing to notice is you can level the tape, the top table up a little bit. Yeah, by if, hand. It, if you see there now, it's not quite, quite, it's not quite, um, I'm not sure that's not quite level. level. So if I do, you just level it up by hand on do the that, side. Literally, just do that with it and it just levels it. It's yeah. just the nature of the uh, scissor jack, it's not a fault with the product. Um, right, so it does come, uh, sorry, before we go, it does come with a uh, sort of a information and instruction leaflet this is about reviews and the company if we turn it around the other side basically other products um, so it's on about oh it's on about the other so they do sell a range of lab bits so you might be interested in them as well if you um, like them. Well, you may have there. even bought something like this before and went oh well, do they sell this a scissor jack yes they do this is used potentially in, in laboratories to raise things up down but you can you can imagine it for modeling if you're painting or sculpting or whatever you're doing crafts anything like that we went for this one just to reiterate because it looked a better build quality online um, and it certainly hasn't disappointed. The build quality is really nice. Um, yeah, it's a well made product. Yeah. Um, so thanks for watching. Um, hopefully, if you found this video, hopefully, you found this video helpful um, in decision whether you're going to buy this product or not. Uh, we do make a lot of videos like this, so feel free to subscribe and, and like the video. We've helped you along a little bit. Uh, can you help us along? Thank you. Yeah, thanks. Bye.